Uh, if it works, let me know. Uh, oh yeah, seems to be working now. Uh, three, three, four. I gotta go. Code eight. Is anyone able to take these two students out? Seven, four, seven. Code five. Alright, uh, back. <coughs> Five oh five is requesting police assistance. Hello. Mica one hundred declaring urgent situation kind of an individual um in cardiac arrest or at least um early stages of a heart attack. Patient sound conscious. We need to notify um comms three three fours off duty, code eight. I hear it. Four three 
Pottery 1, Code 6, the Mount Thomas, and one on Spinal. Mike 100, urgent copies, request additional oh, Micah Paramedic. Um, you can't ask them to up on the student lounge. You need to uh, do that in... Well, I'm not sorry to uh, Micah 100, Pete Larson. Uh, job ID will be 147, requesting additional Micah Paramedic for um, treatment en route to Mount Zion Hospital. Yeah, 118, I can respond. We'll be responding to RD1. Mic 100 received. It's going to be a cardiac patient. Uh, it's going to be critical. Yeah, one eight will receive. Can you just confirmation what that caller ID was? Job ID at one four seven. I dare say on hang away Cypress flat. Well, I will do receive. I dare say they're the five 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 code six to Mount Thomas Hospital with one patient on board. Do you reckon we want to go on one-way funeral? 737 code 6 to Mount Zona to patients on board. Oh, God, oh Jesus Christ. What? Selena, or anything else. Yeah. Uh, she's pissed. Why? Because, uh, she, um, <clears throat> she's been trying to get into AV. Well, I might priority want to call ID one four seven. Uh, put my application in, and within. Uh, five hours, five. My, uh, myself uh, and Mason just attended a call near Humane Labs. So it was active shots fired. Just be weary of calls coming in that area. And Selena's at a, uh, for over a month. <laughs> and uh, when she saw us at uh, TBT South, the uh, to she sent me a text after we left when we were on a um en route. Uh. <laughs> yeah. She sent me a text saying, just close my application, fuck that shit right off, they accept you, Adam and Elijah, and I get ignored, not accepted at all. Fuck AB. Oh. <laughs> she is upset. Oh, did she actually close it? I believe she must have. Oh. I feel for her, I really do. There's so many more inductions to come though. I know. Can someone come pick us up? <laughs> Should we ask Sam if she's available for a tour? Uh, I think Sam was currently busy, but um, I think I'm gonna have to fly out because it's yeah. uh, it's uh, getting pretty late in the head. Oh, um, but I am definitely gonna try and chase up some uh, GMT guys. Yeah. Because uh. Because I know I'll probably have more of a chance of getting a talk during GMT hours. Yeah. Um. But uh, if uh, anybody questions, them, just get them to. Uh, um. If they need me for any reason, Not just the get them to, uh, back on that. Send me an email. Should uh, get back. To, uh, tonight or yeah. early. Later. Early you know. But uh. <coughs> Meantime, uh, <coughs> stay safe and uh, <laughs> bloody hell, oh, yeah. make sure you look after yourself. It's just a job that was. Uh, I just want to go damn tour. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to get annoyed. It's a shame because oh, Max is the fun. one guy that you be oh, uh, uh, tour upping with because uh, because Max is uh, M's M certified, yeah. so you get that experience. It's such hmm. a shame. Uh, uh, Anyway, I'm gonna put my equipment away, and then I'm gonna uh, go and drop my car off. Have so. you seen CAD? Yeah. As soon as we finish, it starts going off. Oh, you're kidding uh. me. <laughs> I cannot wait to be probationary, at least. And the, what's worse, is that I was literally getting comfortable. I was literally getting there. It felt like, it was a bit awkward <laughs> with the, uh, the whole situation. Where yeah. our lives were starting to become endangered. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But other than that, it was actually. Uh, 505. Five, too bad. Uh, and coming up was definitely uh, on the. Uh, yeah. 737, priority 1 to uh, job yeah, I'm going to return my equipment. 505, priority 1 to job uh, 175. How do we actually uh, return it? Hold on. Actually, yeah, that's a good question.
Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure either. I believe... Locker room? Oh, locker room. Sure. I think, no, this is all CFA. <clears throat> Actually, I've never... Do you know how to? Uh, no, I'm not sure either. <laughs> um, oh. Do you know um, Flamingo? Do you know his uh... number at all? I'm actually thinking what we need to do, because I believe that's what we need to do, is, and we're not allowed to do it yet, but we need to pull out an ambulance, fill up the, the equipment in the back, that is five, three, one. and then... I reckon uh, you just keep it on your feet out, but you don't know what to do with it. Yeah, well, we'll be going on duty straight away when I... Uh, I mean, so you probably spot it out. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> you slipping yeah. something in my pocket? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Only because I want my 20, 20 and 5. Yep. So, yeah. I just found 300 and you're better um, 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 units for radiation. I'm just going to notify the student my um, that, uh, Gonna fly out, but try and get two off straight away. Yeah. <laughs> oh, are you waiting for it to up too? Um, yeah, uh, oh, hang on. <laughs> Oops, hang on. This is where it's, this is where it's gonna get boring, is waiting oh. for two ops. Yeah, oh. wait, 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 um, Flamingo, but I'm not sure where he is at the moment. <laughs> I might take a long. Oh, you heard nothing. Oh, it's really up to Flamingo. That was good. It felt good. Yeah. <clears throat> it was fun. Definitely was. Yep, yep. Oh, well, I'm gonna go return my car <clears throat> to the garage. And, uh, okay. triple check to see. Oh, no, I'm not even gonna go bother <laughs> heading to TBT South. I'm just gonna head to the garage and um... get the hell out of here. Hey, <laughs> boys. We'll stay oh, safe. And, right. uh, we'll see you around <laughs> and, uh, Looking forward to seeing the uh, uniform on us at the uh, green. Yeah, that would be good. Um, yeah. One day. Uh, One day. I just gotta go in my head for a few minutes. Okay. Um, Code six two Pillbox Medical One Critical Patient on board. Uh, 
Oh, well, and Michael Owen, 8 to Marco 100, just to see that patient vitals are increasing to stable again. This is 737, can I please have additionals to job 151 at 125 postcode? Seven three seven. Can I please ask if there's any um, available additionals to my location? Yeah. Well, and I got to see. Um, what's the um will be responding uh priority one. Copy. A priority one two seven one seven location ten four seven. One one eight code five uh, seven or seven. 
7. Can I please get some advice on how to treat someone with radiation poisoning and possibly growing something out of his stomach? Mike 100 is confirming patient is suffering from ARS, which is acute radiation syndrome. Mike 100, if you're treating him for radiation, administer him a supply of fluids um, and start him on anti-inflammatories. Get him on oxygen supply ASAP as well. Copy, thank you. Chingling. Uh, well, Knight, go ahead. Uh, myself and Mason have just attended two calls um, near Humane Labs. The last call, or uh, the first call, there was active shots fired. A shot was also taken near myself. Hey, Jack, um, the last call, or uh, as we were treating the patients, they got up, um, and then yet another, what sounded like a sniper, was shot towards them and us. Uh, we have to make sure no one goes up to Humane, maybe, because it seems quite dangerous. Yeah, well not you just see. Well not all paramedics. Can we stay clear of humane labs um with the exception of uh, uh, if you're requested by police, uh you may attend, but for now on can we please stay clear of the humane labs? I'll pass it on to Samantha and Barn to possibly get no go zone. Five oh five, thanks, Jingling. Five oh five priority one to lay call and cut. I hope you haven't been waiting too long. Um, I'm sure there's going to be someone that's able to take you out. I wish I could, but I'm still probationary. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, it's getting quite hectic. But yeah. if you, if one of you want to maybe put out a radio call and just say there's two of us wanting a two up and just tell them you're at the lower peel box, someone should be able to reply. Yeah. Um, channel 5? Yes. And is there some kind of code we've got to say? or, or No, no, no. Just, just say your name and just say that you're looking for a, a two-up. Right. And just say that where you are. Just lower, lower peel box. Lower. Yeah, I was just saying before, right? I was just thinking. I parked my car at the front of peel box. Yeah. And I came I, I, I came here. And when I, I went at the front, the front looks different. And my car's not there. It's like oh, there's okay. two of them. Interesting. Okay. Might be city issues. No, I could show you what I'm talking about if you want. I, where is your car? Is it out the front here or? It's at the front of the other one, not this one. Wait, you're talking about Zona? No, I'm talking about Pillbox. And you parked your car up top? Up top. So is it, is there two grand levels? There's, this is the basement level, right? Technically, because mm. it's, I guess, Underground almost. Uh, Michael, one, one, eight, two. But there's Michael, also up the top um, in the same postcode. So it's like the upper level, I guess. Like 100 received, right, that's why um, I'm thinking there's two, two, there's two of these places. Right. But if your car's parked up there, feel free to bring it down here. Yeah, well, you well, should be able to see where you can park your car just at the front here, where we are. Yeah, anyway, um, all I was saying is that this place is confusing because there's two fronts. 
Yes, there is, yeah. Anyway, put out a radio call. Hopefully someone should be able to take you guys out. I've got to get this uh, person back to where I found them because yeah, there's, a, okay. there's an active scene going. So I will yeah. hopefully see you guys soon. All right. Hi, students. You're doing, good. You're doing great. Yeah. Um, if you want to stay, um, if you want to go do some more, you can, but it feels like it's getting late. 12. I might fly out. I should go up top and put my car away first. There seems to be two fronts. Code six to Mount Stoner, three patients on board. Mike 100 is responding Friday 1 to ARS um, call. Uh, Michael 108 to Michael 100. Um, should we administer should we administer twelve point five milligrams of iodine um, to reduce the radiation? Um, Michael one hundred. Um, I don't know if you have potassium iodide with you. Um, that'll be the effective treatment. Um, however, normally is at a hospital. I did grab a kit with when I left the hospital just then. Um, but if you do have it with you, administer it. Yeah, well, I know, we'll do this. If I just had a look, and we uh, do not have the iodine in the ambulance. Um, if you do have it with you, that'll be great. We'll have to start packing that Mike ambulance just for now. Hi. Hi, Will. How's it going? Uh, 
I'll just play right back. Is anyone at Mount Sona Hospital? Uh, yes. This is 531 currently at Mount Sona. 505, are you able to see if there is a blonde man with no shirt on and a BP cuff around his arm? I'll have a look at the Fez. Uh, is that because he may have possibly Alfred? Uh, yes, while so we were training him. You know, what are you going to do? Gentleman's wearing um, blue jeans as well. And a white mask. A firm, it appears that there's possibly only one in this hospital at this time. So if I want to check outside the hospital as well, he might have just walked away as soon as he um, um, saw the light. A firm will do. Uh, five, yeah, three, one, two, out. Bravo and Charlie, Fair please later. don't um, treat that patient because he tried to rob me earlier, so I am not going to treat that patient. You want to use the corridor? Otherwise, I'll just leave it there. Can't hear you, I don't know what's going on with the sound. Yeah. Can't you pack it in the other oh. things? I don't know, I could try it again. <clears throat> Okay, that worked for that time. First time it didn't work. Remember the other truck I had? Yeah. Oh. So I was trying for this <clears> light <throat> the first time, but the other one I tried. I mean, I tried the other light this time, not this one. <clears throat> yeah. I thought that you might want to do more because you didn't really do much. Cause it just, uh, I mean, you called out the stuff on the radio. Maybe you didn't yeah. actually try it. Anyway. I know, yeah. <clears throat> I got head fucked because I didn't know what I was supposed to do. <clears throat> I mean, I still want to get it right. 
Uh, uh. Yeah, I just don't fancy staying up all night. Uh, they're in there. Put a car in here. I wonder if it does it stay in this until you get it back out again. Don't know. It's a good <clears> question. <throat> so yeah. I, I press A and it says I have no garage cars. So I'm guessing you have oh. to. It stays in this garage. It's like a separate garage. Seven, four, seven. So the normal ones, because I can't get out of there. Board with acute radiation sickness. <clears throat> so you didn't put any in, in this one? No. Mica 100, oh, we're okay. inviting assistance um, on that transport. <clears throat> we're running as intensive care. We'll so find out if it... We have no garage cars. We'll matter find out if it stays there. Go fetch a car and... What's this place? What's that red light for? <clears throat> so something about house options. House. <clears throat> Oh, there was only knock. That's the only option. <clears throat> yeah. So I think I have to put a car in here to be able to get one out from here. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. I'll take you to the garage. I'll take you to the garage. You can fetch <clears throat> one if you want. Or which garage do you want to go to? <clears throat> um, uh, I was saying which one would be easier to go to. Uh, yeah. Uh, there's one up above, on the top of this um, pillbox. Yeah, uh, see, I, uh, I finally got it straightened out. This is a, f this is, looks like a front entrance, but it's at the back of the building. <clears throat> yeah. It's still the same building. I know. I just... <clears throat> when I stood at the front and looked up, I couldn't see any levels above me or anything. That's why I thought it might have been a different building. But it's the same building, just the other side of it. Mike 100, what was that saying again? Sorry. Uh, 505, we are in the waiting bay of Mount <laughs> Zona Hospital. Ah, oh, received. En route. Mike 100, can you please administer him a line of morphine? 
a lot of anti um, uh, anti-inflammatories as well as IV fluid, starting on oxygen as well. And then tomorrow I'll see if they're still there. Oh, I've only got one. I can check that anyway. They're still there though. <clears throat> yeah. Not so bad. Alright. Yeah. Uh, well, I'll, I'll try and grab on. I'll probably just jump onto it. <clears throat> um, two up. In the morning sometime. I've got all day. Yeah. I just don't fancy staying up all night, you know, fly out now and get on in the morning and look for some two ups. <clears throat> yeah. All right, later. Seven four seven, priority one to the latest. Seven code five. <clears throat> 